Hi, guys. Um, I'm just trying to broadcast the class, so just give me a second. It's not working. You know, yes, okay. Uh, hi, Alexander, welcome back. Hey, Samantha. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? Good, good. And hi, Francisco, nice to see you again. Yeah, I think the Hangouts may be still loading. He just joined us. And hi, Victor. Hi, Samantha, nice to see you again. How are Happy you? Happy Friday. <laughs> Woohoo. Do you have any plans for the weekend? Of course. Yeah? What are you doing? Yeah. I will uh, have to... Uh, I will meet with my girlfriend uh -huh. uh, uh, tomorrow evening. Tomorrow evening. Oh, are you going out? Yes. Okay, cool. He, yeah. uh, she invited me mm -hmm. uh, to guest. guest. To be a guest. Yes. <laughs> Good. And <clears throat> Francisco. Hi. Hi, hi. How how are you? Fine, thank you. And you? I'm great, thanks. Uh, do you have any plans this weekend? Yes. No. No work. Woo! <laughs> That's the best thing about the weekend. No work. <laughs> uh, yes. Mhm. Mm and hi, Christopher. Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. And you? Great, I'm good, thanks. Uh, what are you doing this weekend? Ah, this weekend I'm going to a concert. Ooh, very nice. What concert? Which concert? Mm -hmm. It's a. Uh, it's a uh, carry me. It's it's uh, a a group. Uh, in France. Uh, Yes, in France, man. But uh, people don't know this group because uh, it's very little. Oh, I see. Little group. It's a French band. Uh, yes, French band. Yes. Mm -hmm. Cool. Great. Uh, where's the concert? Uh, the concert is uh, in Paris. Do you know where in Paris? Uh, I don't know exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I I'm asking. I lived in Paris for a while, so I'm just curious which um, yeah. which stadium it's at. Um, I'm sure that will be fun. I love concerts, so yes. hope you enjoy it. Um, is that tonight or tomorrow? Uh, to tomorrow. Oh, right. It's late there tonight. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. And hi, Fernando. Fernando. Yeah, I Hi, oh, teacher. There you are. Hi, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. Nice to see you. Uh, what are you doing this weekend? Any plans? No, I will be at home with my family. With maybe we'll make chores. <laughs> uh, do chores, do chores. Yes, do chores. Ugh, that's not fun. <laughs> yes, I agree. <laughs> Okay, good. Um, and Ahmed just joined us. Hi, Ahmed. Hi, teacher again. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you very much. What about you? Uh, what are you doing this weekend? Um, this is normal. Nothing special. Just learn English and maybe go to mall or mm -hmm. make more shopping. Okay. Um, for me, uh, I don't have to work, Yay. Uh, but my best friend is having her baby shower. Do you guys ha know what that is? A baby shower? Yes. Yeah, it's like a party um, for a pregnant person <laughs> before she has her baby. So I've been very busy planning it the last week, so I've planned it for her. With many games and many gifts. Yeah, lots of games. Lots of games that she hates. She doesn't like, um, you know, they put a bow on you and all these silly games, but I think she'll have fun. <laughs> and lots of chocolate and treats and stuff. It should be fun. Um, and then on Sunday, I'm going hiking. So that's going to be fun too, in a forest. You know in Canada, we have lots of... 
green, lots of trees and stuff, so it's a nice place for hiking. Um, okay. Interesting. That means you have a busy weekend. Busy weekend, and yeah. I'm sure I'll be very sore on Monday from all the exercise. <laughs> okay. So we're playing, um, well, playing, speaking. Uh, it's called Would You Rather. You might have um, answered some Would You Rather questions before, uh, but the game is a little bit different. So the way you play is, oh, this one's really strange. I'll find a better one. Okay, would you rather, for example, be unable to open doors unassisted or be unable to climb stairs? So would you rather need help opening doors or need help climbing stairs? So if this is my question, hmm, let's see. I think I would rather the second one because we have elevators and escalators <laughs> to help us. Or you could use a cane. <laughs> but if you can't open a door, it would be very frustrating. So this one. Um, and when I click on it, it tells me how many people agree. <laughs> so it's, uh, it's interesting. It says 51% of people agree with me. Um, would anyone rather the first option? No, I no? guess it's quite quite obvious that uh, opening door is like uh, essential skill and <laughs> climbing <Yeah. laughs> stairs is, yeah, you can live without it. Yeah, I think so. Because if you can't open a door, like, you could never be in a room privately, really. <laughs> Always need help. Mm. Yeah, okay. Uh, so that's, that's how it works. Um, I'm going to the next one. And this one is for you, Ahmed. Are you ready? I'm warning you, some of these questions are very strange, okay? <laughs> okay, here we go. Can you read it? Yeah, would you rather die a hero or live long enough to see you still become the villain? What means Vill by villain? The villain is the bad guy. Oh. No, uh, I would, uh, I think I would rather uh, die a hero okay. uh, better than uh, live long enough uh, and many people uh, like hate me and many people hope to die quickly because like we are human and we want like be friendly and like activity activity so others like like us and we like the others mm -hmm. and also like uh, who like believe uh, I think they they don't want to be bad guys then after they die like uh, maybe go to fire or something like oh, that. Oh yeah that's true too if you're yeah. Religious. yeah. So better to die someone die a hero and all like people remember him Mm -hmm. And also after that, maybe he like uh, went to go to the heaven. Mm -hmm. Heaven, heaven. Heaven, yeah. Would anyone prefer the second option? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do you have like an explanation? No, well, don't you like Two Face? <laughs> it's it's quite um, uh, you know a popular quote from Batman. Uh, it's yeah. Harvey, Harvey Dent said it, so yeah, uh, yeah. I'm, I'm a fan of Two Face. So oh, you're a Two Face guy. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so, so <laughs> definitely, I would I, I would live long enough to see myself become a villain. Okay, what do you think? Do you think which one is more popular? I guess Die Hero is. Yeah. Okay. Should be should be more popular. Oh yeah, much more popular this one. Okay. <laughs> All right, very good, Ahmed. Let's go to the next one. This one's for you, Alexander. Can you read it? Okay. Uh, so, <laughs> so would you rather chop off uh, uh, your own arm or chop off a complete stranger's arm, uh, but they can come back to kill you in 30 years? <laughs> um, yeah, that's a tough one. <laughs> <laughs> um, I guess... 
Let's be honest. I chop off a complete stranger some. <laughs> <laughs> and you would just accept that they'll kill you in 30 years? <laughs> no, they, they, they'll they come back to kill me. No. <laughs> they oh. should try hard to do it. So I have 30 years to prepare. <laughs> and they will have only one arm. So <laughs> That's true. You do have the advantage. <laughs> right. Okay. Um, would anyone choose the first option? Hmm, I see. <laughs> would you? Me? No, I'd do number two. <laughs> <laughs> I'm with you, then I'll train train mean for 30 years so they can't hurt me. <laughs> okay. Ah, yeah, it's much more popular. Okay, very good. Uh, Francisco, you're next. Here we go. <clears throat> well, they're supposed to be... Um, like quotation marks, I guess it's broken. Um, can you read? Can you read it for us, Francisco? Have a terrible audition on American Idol. Mm -hmm. Get a ridiculously easy question wrong on who wants to be a millionaire. Good. Do you know these two shows? Uh, the the second, the second. Yeah, I'll just show you a quick. Uh, American Idol is like this. It's a, a very popular singing competition in America. So you sing. Um, and then who wants to be a millionaire? It's in a lot of countries, this one. Like this. Yes, I, I know these. So what do you think? Uh, I get a ridiculous easy question and be a, a millionaire. I prefer. Okay, so you'd rather that than sing? Uh, sing? No, no, I, 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 I have a terrible voice to, <laughs> to sing. Okay. Uh, <laughs> this would be very embarrassing too. Uh, but, but, but the... In the finale, I I get no I get millionaire. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> okay, so it's, it's my 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 mission. Of course, I would love to be a millionaire. <laughs> um, would anyone choose the first option? No. No. <laughs> okay. Oh, a lot of people like the first option. Huh. Uh, I guess because they want to be famous. You can be very famous on American Idol. <laughs> uh, uh, okay. Go to the next one. This one's for you, Victor. Can you read it? Yes, spend a... Uh year with the Pope, spent a year with the Dalai Lama. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think a uh, red one. A red. Yeah? <laughs> okay, <laughs> why? Uh, uh, um, but <laughs> because uh, it's very... Uh, uh, Forgot the sword. Uh, uh, very fam famous and uh, wise uh, man he was. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. But um, I don't know who is Pope. You don't know the Pope? Really? Yes. Oh no. <laughs> Guys, does anyone know who the Pope is? He sure. is Jog. He's a head, no, he's the head uh, of the uh, of the church in uh, like in Vatican. Yeah. Oh. Do you understand? He's the head of of the church. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Uh, uh, because uh, uh, I didn't know uh, that he he called in in english like pop because in in my language uh, uh, he he uh, he called a little bit different oh okay 
But yes. now you know who he is. Would you still choose the Dalai Lama? Yes. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Would anyone prefer the Pope? Uh, me, because his name is Francisco. <laughs> okay, that's a good reason, I think. <laughs> yes. I think I would go crazy, maybe, um, but I'm not very religious, so. Um, <laughs> okay, let's see. Which one do you think is more popular? Mm, I guess Dalai Lama should be more popular. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wow, much more popular. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Next one is for Ahmed. Here we go. Hmm. Okay. Would you rather be married to someone? Who is a know-it-all or very ignorant? So this is about your wife. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, you mean uh, like it mean, but I know it all. Like I know very well. A know-it-all is um, mm -hmm. it's slang for a person who thinks they know everything. So they're probably very smart, but they can be a little bit annoying. Like, uh -huh. they always have to be right, um, and they think they know they know it all. <laughs> they know everything. <laughs> and then ignorant is, you, maybe you know ignorant. It's like the opposite. <laughs> you don't really know anything. Yeah. Uh, actually, it's difficult. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no one of them, but if I have uh, no choice, it's... Uh, it's uh, uh, maybe I will uh, choose uh, the first one, knowing it all. Okay. Yeah. Because maybe I can, um, like, uh, at least uh, depend on him because he thought he like, like very confident uh, about himself because he thought like he know everything. Yeah. Uh, but the, yeah, but the, uh, who like don't have confidence about himself? Maybe then like after like because it is not he not stop about what he don't know. But he like be like how can I say like chick? He not like confident with the others also, right? Oh, um, not confident around other people. Yeah, maybe. Mm -hmm. I'm not uh, sure, but. Uh, not self-confident. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not self-confident. So I prefer the first one, and maybe sit with him and discuss like uh, uh, discuss. Sorry, sit with him and discuss what I see is right and what is wrong. Maybe we can reach the some point. Mm -hmm. But because like who like. Uh, like uh, very ignore it. He, he also like what you say. Uh, he consider it as a, a right thing. And yeah, that's maybe true. The, yeah. <laughs> and so if they're ignorant, is like, uh, then you are. Is, right. is, is is yeah. Is, is very comfortable for someone who want to marry. It. But maybe this like guy who like after like he will be husband. Maybe he did uh, he do something wrong. And she will not say to him, "You are doing wrong." And I think everyone in the world uh, do something wrong sometimes. And maybe, me, yeah, maybe and the, me. The, the know-it-all should marry the ignorant person. <laughs> that is, that <laughs> yeah. is perfect, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, so you choose the blue one, right? Yep. Okay. Does anyone think the red one is better? No. Do you think that the blue is more popular? It should be. It should be, yeah, it should be. <laughs> oh, yeah. Whoa. 80% <laughs> to 20%. Okay. Um, okay, Alexander, here we go. <laughs> oh, this is ridiculous. Okay, okay, so would you rather be a vampire or a werewolf? Um... <laughs> Yeah, that's funny. <laughs> hmm. I I guess uh, do werewolves have some drawbacks? Like, uh, <laughs> I mean, vampires can stand sun, and uh, do werewolves have something? You know, oh, some weak like weakness. A weakness. Yeah. Um, I don't I don't know. Hold on, I'm gonna look. Werewolf okay. weakness. 
It mu there must there must be something because we know about vampires. There's garlic, sun, yeah. and silver bullets, right? Werewolves are allergic to silver bullets too. So it looks like just silver. <laughs> okay, of course, so. they're not real. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right. So let it be a werewolf then. Okay. You you want to you, yeah okay, they're both a little weird. <laughs> Would anyone prefer to be a vampire? No. I forgot. Uh, I guess vampires live forever and werewolves not. <laughs> mm, that's true. But all <laughs> yeah. they can eat is blood. Um, yeah, maybe maybe they like it. <laughs> so uh. it's not it's not like uh, something bad for them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's hard to imagine, but uh. yeah, yeah, of course. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's very close. Look, right. it's because it's such a strange question. <laughs> okay, the next one is for Francisco. Here we go. Okay, can you read it for us, Francisco? Uh. <clears throat> Tell your most embarrassing secret to the ten people. It will matter no more. It uh, and five hundred. Five thousand. Five thousand. Five thousand. Uh, liquor, liquor, rice, jelly, beans, as fast as as you can. Do you know what licorice jelly beans are? Uh, no. Let me show you licorice. Licorice is this. Do you recognize it? Ah, yes, yes. Yeah? yes so, yes. It, and then jelly beans? They're yes. the, black, the black jelly beans. Yes. They're horrible. <laughs> well, maybe you like them. <laughs> I don't know. Um, it's uh, candies, like candies. Yeah, licorice flavored jelly beans. So, would you rather eat 5,000 really, really, really fast <laughs> or tell 10 people your most embarrassing secret? The people who would care the most about no, it. No, no, I prefer it uh, 500 licorice 5, jelly beans. 5,000. This one is 500 with two zeros. Three zeros yes. is 5,000. Ah, yeah, thank you. Mm -hmm. I, I prefer uh, eat uh, or drink um, 5,000 jelly beans. <laughs> I think you would get very sick. <laughs> no. But, um, but, but, but I don't uh, like to tell my ten secret. <laughs> I know. Me neither. <laughs> um, okay. Would anybody choose the blue one? Um, I would. I'm just yeah. trying to think about my most embarrassing secret, and you know, it's not so bad. <laughs> So, <laughs> I guess I can live with it. <laughs> I guess it depends. It depends on your secret, right? <laughs> right, right. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's pretty close. It's pretty close. Most people choose the jelly beans. <laughs> okay. Um, hi, Ken. Welcome. And, okay, Victor. Hello. Hello, hello. Ready? Uh, yes. Oh my gosh, the second one is awful. Okay, if you are forced to eat a certain way, can you read your options? Uh, yes. Eat uh, soup for every meal with only your face. <laughs> <laughs> Stop your tongue with a fork every time you ate. Uh, do you understand both? And uh, not uh, no uh, no clearly. Can you explain a little? Bit? Yeah. Okay. Let me show you. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, so, well, I only have a glass of water, but this is my soup, right? Mm -hmm. Eating it with your face is like this. Oh, no, good. no spoon. Like uh, it yeah, the fork is this this silverware with uh, yeah. three or four, like, prongs. So yes, yes. Stab your food, and then eh, <laughs> you have to stab your tongue here. Yes. So okay. Which one uh, would you choose? Uh, I think if, um, blue blue one. The blue one. It, it, it's it's soup for <laughs> every meal with only your face, maybe. <laughs> Much less painful. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> okay. Let's uh, see. Because the uh, red one is dangerous. Would anyone prefer the red one? No, I think it would hurt too it's much. It's very strange. <laughs> yeah, everyone likes the blue one. <laughs> okay. Ahmed, it's your turn. I think I know which one you'll choose. It's like your last question. Let's choose a different one, actually. <laughs> okay. Ahmed, go ahead. Would you rather always look eight months pregnant or always have a black E? A black eye. A black eye, sorry. It's like this. Okay. Oh, nice. <laughs> when someone punches you in the face. <laughs> Okay, what, what what do you choose? You look very fat, <laughs> pregnant, or you always have a black eye? Mm, I think I would choose uh, the second one, have a black eye, because maybe I get some treatment and then it will disappear, uh, this. But if I have, uh, like, look, eight months pregnant, I that means I need to work much about myself and do many exercise in many hours uh, to lose this weight and I think it is so difficult especially this like uh, uh, the weight where it be in the around the stomach it is hard to lose it yeah it is not, uh, it is not like uh, uh, the weight in another place in the body so it is so hard, I think, and I don't like to be like bringing them. <laughs> and I like have difficult to use any like some clothes. Yeah, and I think not comfortable, not healthy. Like there's many reasons. Uh, black eye like not, uh, yeah. But when someone like have a uh, black uh, eye, maybe he is like. See, show sure that he's a strong man and do many <laughs> trouble. <laughs> it looks like you're uh, always in, in fights and you're a tough yeah, guy. <laughs> yeah, and many people pray from him. <laughs> Would anyone no pre to. prefer to look pregnant? <laughs> no. Okay. Yeah. Everyone says black eye. <laughs> uh, I, I prefer... <laughs> Pregnant. What? <laughs> I can say I am fat or something like that. You prefer look to look pregnant? Yeah, black eyes se seems uh, kind of abusing. So. Yeah, that's true. You look very violent. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, okay, Ken. The next one is yours. Okay. Would you rather forget who you are? Forget who everyone you know is. Ah, <laughs> strange <laughs> question. Forgetting who I am, uh, I lost my identity. It's fearful, yeah, but uh, exactly. also yeah. everyone who you know, uh, I forget everyone I know is also troublesome. So, uh, difficult to choose. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, maybe. Uh, forgetting uh, my identity is more scary than forgetting uh, other people. I know. Okay. So I chose blue. So you'd rather forget your identity? Yeah. Okay. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, no. I was 
You choose red? Red, red. Red, okay. Yes. Okay, you can always meet new people, right? <laughs> what about <laughs> your family? <laughs> uh, they are dead again. <laughs> mm, does anyone choose blue? Uh, I think if I have choose... Uh, I have to choose. If I have to choose uh, uh, this state, uh, both of the statements, I would, uh, I would like to try uh, uh, every single statement <laughs> <laughs> because uh, I, for not long time, because I think it's uh, may, may be interested. <laughs> Okay. But not not forever, but not long. No, time. just for like a temporary. Yes. Something temporary, right? Okay. Let's see. Oh, most of you, most people agree with Ken. Oh wait, no, you chose the red, Ken, didn't you? Yeah. Oh, most people disagree with you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mm, okay. Let's see. The next one is for Alexander. Okay, so would you rather never be able to feel emotions or never be able to express emotions? Hmm. Oh. Interesting. Um, yeah. Um, I guess... I guess I would choose the red one just because uh, if I can feel my emotions, you know, all, all, uh, all I can express is nothing or I just be faking and uh, you know it's it would be too hard to uh, like lie all the time mm -hmm. trying to express something so when you're not not feeling it exactly uh, really so uh, yeah I think uh, I would choose never be able to express emotions okay would anyone choose the blue one you can never feel them uh, if you yes, if you can't yeah, I if should choose blue because if I can, if I don't feel anything, I don't need to express my emotion. <laughs> <laughs> you would be a very boring person. <laughs> no emotion. <laughs> okay, let's see. Uh, most, most people agree with Alexander here. And as a as a bonus to the second one, you could always have a poker face, and you know, ah, always win. That's true. You could become a poker champion. Uh, I think in our day, uh, present day, a lot of people uh, try to um, not show your emotion. I think it's uh, uh, usually it's. Uh, Top managers try to do it. Uh -huh. Well, it depends on who you're talking to. Uh, I don't think you're trying to hide your emotions when you're talking to your mother. <laughs> Maybe. Unless you're lying. <laughs> 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 okay. All right. Next one, Francisco. Here we go. <laughs> oh, this is so weird. Okay. Can you read it? Uh, stop a towel, a tail, stop a horn. Okay, sprout a tail or sprout a horn. So let me show you. This is a tail, like on an animal, a tail, yeah? Yes. And then a horn is like on a unicorn. Oh, no, not like this. Hold on. Um. Like this. No. <laughs> so, and sprout, they mean uh, grow, grow. Uh, I prefer sprout a tail. <laughs> okay, why? Uh, because a horn is a, a bad thing in, in, my, in my country. Okay. What, but what, what do you mean it's a bad thing? Like in religion? No, no, in fidelity with the... Uh, ah, I see. In the... It's, it's not good. <laughs> yeah, okay. Infidelity. Fidelity. Yes. 
Mm-hmm. Okay. So it's like a symbol. Yes. Okay. Um, would anyone prefer the horn? No? Well, maybe if you're like a f- fight champion or something. <laughs> Everyone wants a tail. Okay. <laughs> okay. Victor, here we go. Okay. Have have gravity shut off for one day. And uh, have everyone around you go in, in insane uh, and want to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> Do you understand them? Yes. Okay. Uh <laughs> what do you think? Uh, I think first one, blue. blue okay. One. Why? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I can never think about that. But I, um, I thought uh, that if uh, gravity uh, uh, has changed some days like weather maybe uh-huh if if it's uh, if it's happened uh, some uh, some object uh, weight uh, in uh, in different day uh, uh, some object has different weight for example uh-huh you yeah. understand me what yeah, happened yeah i know it um if one object weighs more more than another no, in in uh, different. Uh, for example, um, uh, gravity of our Earth uh, has changed in uh, some days, in, like weather. Is it true? No, no, it's not true. If it happens, <laughs> if it happens. happens. <laughs> yes. Um, but, but it we... would be like you're in outer space or <laughs> on the moon. <laughs> in one day, you have you have weight like. Uh, 16 uh, kilos in another yeah. day you have uh, weight 65 kilos what oh. <laughs> <It's my laughs> it would feel different for sure yes. um, okay so you prefer the first one right yes I don't know why what I... would anyone like everyone th- like the red one sure uh, oh. <laughs> Okay, uh, I wouldn't like to like spoil everything, yeah. but uh, the thing is, if you uh, shut off the gravity even for like five minutes, you you're gonna die anyways, because uh, the atmosphere will go away instantly to the space. All the water from Earth will go away to the space, and so uh, and we're all second, dead. <laughs> yeah, with with the second uh, option, you have at least a chance to live. <laughs> this is true. This is true. You have to train for this again, but l- hopefully you've already trained from cutting off that man's arm. So yeah, right, right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, everybody chooses the first one, but no one thought of it Alexander's way. That's why. <laughs> okay, very good. Um, hi, David. Welcome. Welcome to our strange class. <laughs> hi, teacher. Thanks. Yeah. Okay, Ahmed, here we go. Oh, this one's a little bit serious. Okay, can you read them, Ahmed? Sure. If you could only save lives through two ways, would you rather prevent world war two and all the war-related deaths that went along with it, Holocaust included, or cure all forms of cancer and STDs. 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 AIDS included. Good. AIDS included. Do you know what STDs are? No. Okay. I know cancer and AIDS. The STDs, I don't know. Sexually transmitted diseases, like herpes. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay, great. So? I will choose the second one. Okay, can you explain? Uh, sure. Like, um, I think, uh, uh, f- first of all, when these diseases, cancer and AIDS, uh, especially cancer, like someone who's have 
uh, family relative and he had uh, cancer or has cancer and cannot do anything to him and see like die uh, front of his eyes and uh, cannot front of his of uh, one eyes and cannot do anything to help him. Mm -hmm. uh, I think like they have like uh, more pain because he you know like he will uh, lose is uh, one of uh, one member of his family of one family uh, through two or three months maybe maximum one year or two years uh, but the war like uh, the second war and the holocaust like many people die uh, like in small uh, a few in a few months and i think the war learn big lesson from this war uh -huh. uh, from this war like they learn war it is uh, so uh, expensive 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 and we will lose many people if you do like uh, war again and if, I think they, say, um, if we have another war if we have another if, war. if we have another war mm -hmm. uh, so I think uh, the war the world war two uh, like uh, people around the world and the government learn like a uh, big lesson from it. Okay. Uh, yeah, but this like cancer and ideas, like they die, many people die from it. Mm -hmm. And they have been uh, through the, when they uh, die, they, like they not die like normally. They suffer, so, you can say. They suffer, yeah. They suffer and other relatives, they suffer because they, what they love and what they like, they suffer. Would anyone choose the blue one? Mm, I guess not. They're both terrible, obviously, but um, mm -hmm. I think Ahmed made some good points about the red one. And yep. it affects the whole future too, right? Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. Everybody agrees. Look at that. Okay. All right, Ken, you're up. Here we go. <laughs> me? Me or? Yeah, Ken, yeah. It's okay, where an iPad have a peg pick, leg? What is peg leg? Okay, let me show you. It's like a pirate. Ah. A wooden iPad. leg. <laughs> iPad <laughs> and the eye patch. Yar. <laughs> okay, so Mr. Pirate, what do you choose? Uh, a blue. Okay, the eye patch. Why? Because uh, that's more cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay, a peg leg would be very frustrating. <laughs> Yeah, but, but I guess you have to take both if you want to be a pirate. <laughs> yeah, that's true. You can't have one without the other. It's true. Okay, let's see. Everybody agrees again. Okay. Um, okay, Alexander, here we go. Okay, so would you rather have a large painting of yourself or have a life-size sculpture of yourself? <laughs> Why do you uh, want either? Yeah. Uh, hmm. I guess I'd have a large painting of myself because, I don't know, having a sculpture of myself feels weird. Um, I mean, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, you know, it's, uh, it reminds me of the personality cult or something like that. Yeah, and, yeah. <laughs> and, um, and the painting is like, it's a regular thing. So, yeah, mm -hmm. uh, I think I'll choose a painting. Okay. Would anyone prefer to have a sculpture? No, it's really strange. Like, <laughs> I would not want a sculpture of myself. Oh, most people actually like the red one. Huh. Okay, interesting. Okay, David, it's your turn. Oh, this one's horrible. Okay, David, can you read your cards? Yes. I don't know what swear means. Okay, swear is words. like bad words. I can't say them in class. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
cursing, curse words, bad words. So would you rather yell a swear word between every word or get punched in the face <laughs> every time you swear? Do you understand? Yeah, well, yes. No, yeah, no, not yet. <laughs> yeah, I swear between every words. Okay, so it would be like this. Um, hello, I'm gonna type something because I ca I really can't. Um. <laughs> swear is a bad word. Yeah. I tried Swear to type it, it didn't work. Can it be a kind of promise? No, yes, but in this case, oh my gosh, how do I explain it without <laughs> saying it? Like the F word? <laughs> F? Yeah, I understand okay. now. So if you yell a bad word, so it's like, hello, and then you have to swear <laughs> like every time you speak, or after you swear, someone punches you. Punch blue. in the face. I blue. <laughs> like this. <laughs> no. The blue? Yes. Every single time you speak? <laughs> yes. Okay. Would anyone A choose... A little bad word. No problem. Would anyone choose the, the red? Yeah, I would. Because, I mean, uh, yeah, you have to be the most polite people in, on the planet, but uh, still... Uh, uh, you know, hey, you're, uh, you still have a chance to get punched in the face if you swear, uh, if you swear uh, between every word. So. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, uh, it's actually very likely that you'll get punched. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so sooner or later, you, you're gonna get punched anyway. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's actually fairly close. <laughs> most most <laughs> people chose the red one. Okay, and um, Francisco. <laughs> yeah, you're right. He does. <laughs> Talks like the blue one. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and Ozzy Osbourne, too. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah, he's very bad. Oh. Okay, Francisco. Here we go. Oh, I don't like that one. I don't like that one. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely don't want to talk about Joseph. Okay. <laughs> Here you go, Francisco. Can you read uh, always have mute in your shoes. Always have uh, peel in your shoes. Okay, so know. mud. It's like this. Mud. Yuck. Ah, yes. And then a pebble. It's like a very small rock. Yeah. Like this. These are pebbles. Okay? Yes. Which one? I prefer uh, always have nude in, in my in my shoes. You always have mud. 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 In, in my shoes. Okay. Uh, Why? <laughs> because... Uh, because uh, I don't like people. It's a. Uh, it's more. Um, it hurts. Uncomfortable. It's uncomfortable. It's not uh, uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. uh, a mood is. N it's not uh, so uncomfortable. Okay. I think. Yeah. Okay. Mm, would anyone choose uh, the blue one? Or, sorry, the red one? I don't know. Having a mud in my shoes is, you know, kind of gross, too. So, uh, maybe, awesome. maybe you can live with a pebble after after some time. <laughs> you get <laughs> used to it. Can, then. Yeah, yeah, like, tape tape the pebble to one, one place. <laughs> so, right. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Uh, it's very close. This one. Look at that. Okay. Yes. Uh, okay, Ahmed. 
Okay. Would you rather be a content failure or an unhappy success? So it means would you be happy but fail or unhappy but successful? Uh, difficult question. <laughs> yeah. Uh, like content fail, I mean like uh, uh, someone uh, like continue fail. Next yeah, year, right? you're, you, you're always failing. You always saying but happy, right? Or does not matter? Pardon? Like uh, make fail, made, make fail, but uh, happy. Yeah, like, exactly. So you're happy, but you fail all the time. Uh, you fail at everything. Uh -huh. Or the I other one I'll... is you're unhappy, but you're always a success. You always you're always successful. I if like this, I will choose the first one. Be a content failure. Because I think the most uh, important thing uh, who like person uh, have uh, satisfy in 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 them in their self uh, in their self. So if someone has uh, satisfy and uh, contain failure, that I mean uh, he they uh, going try and uh, also uh, he try new things. Mm -hmm. But who like unhappy success like maybe he's like doing the same thing and also he not satisfied in their in, in their self. So no one want to like uh, live uh, unhappy because life is short and if you not to spend uh, your time with happy and relax, I think this is not life. This is okay. like. <laughs> it would make you very stressed. You'd be yeah. very stressed, yeah. Would anyone yeah. choose the red? No, it's better to be happy, right? Sure. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Uh, okay, Ken, one more for you. Okay. Oh, this is strange. Can Teenage you read the whole I... thing from the top? Okay, if you have a baby and the technology existed, would you rather genetically after your child uh, leave it to nature? Hmm? Genetically after, uh, after your child, okay. Yeah, change. No, change, okay. Ah, leave it to nature. Okay, no. why? Because, uh, you know, oh. Mm, but uh, you know, if the child has a serious problem or physical problem or something like that, some di disease, I would uh, choose blue. It's up to the condition of the baby. Okay. But, uh, basically, leave it to the nature is the safe for humans and for humans' balance of kind of mm -hmm. how can I say? Uh, because uh, now the human has a variety. So every single humor has a meaning of that kind of, how can I say, diversity. Mm -hmm. So even though uh, the baby uh, was diagnosed uh, for the, the disease or something, maybe... Diagnosed. Diagnosed baby, but if that uh, number of baby reduced, it might cause some balance of the, our humans, so mm -hmm. in, in total. But um, if, if uh, talking about my baby, I would alter uh, the child if that happened. Mm -hmm. mm. So <laughs> my answer is... Oh, yeah, if they were uh, sick or something is wrong. Uh, yeah, if it is necessary, I, I would choose uh, blue. Okay. Yeah. What does everyone else think? It's kind of a tough question. Yeah, would anyone uh, like definitely choose blue? Well, it depends on the society. Like, imagine a world where uh, every everybody is enhanced in some genetical way, maybe augmented, and so uh, if you leave your child to nature, he'll be uh, like an outlier, and he can't do anything, because he would be, uh, um, like, worse from the beginning, just because all other people are augmented, enhanced, and so on. So mm -hmm. you, you just have to do it then. Yeah, I see. Like, because the technology exists, Probably other people are doing it, so... Yeah, yeah, so just uh, it would be hard for him to live as a, like, uh, a normal human being. So mm -hmm. he has to, like, have better brains, better eyes, and so on. 
This one is all very circumstantial. It depends. It depends, right, on the circumstance. Yeah. Let's see. Ah, it's pretty close, but most people chose the red one. Um, okay, let's do one more, Alexander. Here we go. Okay. So, would you rather be looking in person or be better looking in person or be better looking in photos? Um, I think I'd rather be better looking in person because... Yeah, uh, too. Um, I mean, it's it's the way you communicate with other people, and uh, it, it's it is the way that uh, it is uh, like what matters. Because mm -hmm. uh, you you your uh, wife or husband will, wouldn't choose you by photos, and if she sees your beautiful photos and then see your in real life like an ugly uh, some some ugly creature, and <laughs> your, your your good photos won't help you. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, does anyone think the photos option is better? Uh, uh, I think okay, photo why? is better because I have many photos in Facebook in the <laughs> other in the other uh, application. Mm -hmm. It's better uh, the photo is uh, is better looking in photos. Uh huh. Okay. All right. Well, let's see which one is more popular. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Everybody says blue. <laughs> okay. Um, all right. I think we'll end it there. Uh, if you feel like playing with your friends, it's a pretty fun game. Uh, it's just you rather dot com. So um, there's another game. Have you guys heard of Cards Against Humanity? No. What is it? I don't think it's appropriate for class, but. Um, it's it's uh, it's hilarious. It's a very funny game. So for to play with your friends, <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna give you the link. But okay. some of some of the cards are a little inappropriate. <laughs> <laughs> but it's very funny. It's really really funny. Uh, they have them in other languages, but it's good practice in English if you have some friends um, that you practice speaking with. Okay. Um, and yeah, that's it. So. I'll be back in a few hours with a uh, grammar class, so maybe I'll see you there. If not, have a great weekend, okay? Thanks for Bye. coming. Okay, thank, you. thank you, teacher. Bye. 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 Bye, guys. See you. Bye.